Hello, now welcome back. Today, a bit of a special day. I've come down to my friends here at uh, Oakley Motorcycles in Maidstone to be honest here, have a go on a bike I've really, really been looking forward to having a go on. Now this is just a little bit of a, a Muse Boot show to speak because I've got one coming from Yamaha uh, for two weeks to actually live with, uh, so I'll do something a little bit more detailed on it then. However, I just wanted to come and have a go on one and uh, my buddy Paul said, come down, got a demo day going on, come down and take one out. So it'd be rude not to. So we're looking at the XSR 900 GP, uh, based on the uh, popular XSR 900, a 900cc triple uh, Yamaha CP3 engine. But of course, as you can see, it's a little bit more special. This is basically just an amalgamation of all the post bikes I had as a kid growing up in the uh, late 80s and early 90s. I'm looking at this and I'm seeing FZR, I'm seeing TZR, I'm seeing YZF, I'm seeing TRX. And to top it all off, it's in what Yamaha are calling Legend Red. Now, Legend Red, to me and you that grew up in the 80s and 90s, I'm just going to say it, it's Marlborough, isn't it? This is, to me, a Wayne Rainey, Eddie Lawson, Freddie Spencer replica, Luther Cadlora. I mean, look at it, it's just absolutely freaking gorgeous. One thing that Paul's done is he's got the racer kit on the way for it. Uh, slightly tidier rear end there. Uh, they've got the fairings coming soon, I believe. But they've got rid of what I think is honestly a pug ugly exhaust uh, that came on, comes on it as standard. And they've fitted the aftermarket Acroprovic straight from Yamaha, which I think adds to the look. I mean, looking at the frame, it is based on the, uh, on the XSR, but they've stripped it back to the, the alloy silver. And looking at it, it's just screaming Delta box. Absolutely screaming Delta box from the 80s and 90s. And to me, it's absolutely stunning. I remember seeing the pre-production version at Goodwood last year, the DB40. As I said, I was watching it and I said to the guy from Yamaha, if that makes production, you have just hit a target demographic right on the head. Old farts like me now in our mid forties that grew up absolutely worshiping these bikes. This bike is targeted directly at us. It's a direct hit on our heartstrings. He just laughed and smiled because I think he knew what was coming because about two months later, boom, images of this were dropped. And now, as I say, I'm going to get one for a bit of a longer period very soon. But for now, let's go and get a lid on. Let's go and have a look. Can't wait. Let's fire it up. Lovely sound. Let's get the gloves on. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. She's a beauty. She's an absolute beauty. Let's go. This feels lovely, it's smooth. It's everything I was kind of hoping it would be so far. But as I just said, on my helmet cam there, this bike is everything I was expecting from it. I just fell in love with the original XSR 900 last year when I rode it. And this is just an improvement upon that in my mind. It's so smooth, it's so compliant. The engine just feels great. You open it up and it just accelerates on tap with a relentless pull, but it's smooth, it's seamless. The quick shifter is, well, it's just like butter. And the handling is sublime. You just point it in any direction and it will just happily take you there without any fuss. It doesn't feel hurried, it doesn't feel rushed, it doesn't feel nervous. It just feels so secure and planted. The brakes are, well, they're typically brilliant and the suspension just feels, well, it just feels absolutely spot on just out of the box for me. I've been really impressed with this bike so far. I've only had, what, an hour, hour and a half out on it and I've just fallen in love with it. This is actually the bike that could steer me away from my Ducati, I'll be honest with you. I'll make a more formal opinion on it once I've had a chance to ride it properly and I've had a chance to live with it. So keep watching this space, but until then, hope you enjoy the rest of the video. I'll absolutely love it. Absolutely love it.